Look at the ways you can immediately open your presentation with impact and engage your audience. Many professionals, and of course most of my work is in the business world, they are absolutely fine once they get going and talk about what they're experts in. Very few know how to open and conclude well. So we tell them to come out punching. Welcome to You Have Choices, Options of Openings, The Techniques. As you soon will come to discover, our subtitle is How to Open Your Presentation with Impact. At the beginning of a speech, presentation, seminar, client meeting, report to senior management, sales presentation, or any manner of presentation you deliver, you need to arouse interest in the subject. After all, we stand in the rain to see a movie. Would you stand in the rain to listen to your presentation? Do you think they would? One of the past presidents of my local chapter of the National Speakers Association Northern California, Gary Puris, used to be in the advertising business. And his job was to come up with the advertising campaigns to promote movies. In fact, can you believe when Spielberg finished Raiders of the Lost Ark, they had absolutely no idea who their market was. And he brought Don Garrett in to speak to our chapter. And he was the person who hired Gary for the different studios for the campaigns. And he told us of all the millions and millions of dollars it takes to create a movie, half of the costs is the promotion and the marketing and advertising. But he said it doesn't matter how many millions of dollars we invest, that doesn't make a movie a success. We spend all the money advertising and marketing so we have a good opening so we can get our money back in case the movie isn't a success. But he said, what makes a movie a success? And I believe it probably what helps build your career is five memorable moments. He said, it's the five moments when you walk out of a movie house and you say to your friends, Oh, could you believe that opening? D did you know that was going to happen? When did the little boy know that he was dead? And then you go to work the next day and say, you have got to see this movie. I can't tell you, but you've got to see it. And you start retelling the scenes, how you felt. And don't you think when you talk about Peter Legg telling the story about surprising his daughter in London, or saying goodbye to his father for the last time, or seeing Vince on that chair. Aren't these the moments that you're going to talk about? And I would challenge us all to look at our presentations and see where are the moments. And certainly the emotional connection when an audience says, wow, they're talking just to me. That'll be a moment.